Hey guys, just wanted to give you a quick overview of the thermostat and the menu system and kind of give you help into getting around a little bit uh, within the system. So to get to the menu, you first hit the menu button, or the enter button in the middle of the dial. And that'll bring up the menu. Scroll the dial clockwise to go down. And it'll show you everything on the main screen. The first one here where you can see the cursor blinking is the set and reset program. Yeah, select that one if you want to start a new program or set the manual temperature. Essentially basically every the main features of everything is where you enable it under this menu. Uh, I put reset under there because if you reselect one that's already running it'll start over again. Uh, adjust the current program will give you some options to adjust the current program and the features inside of it. So you, if you want to change the time or the stage or reset a stage, you can do that in there. Here's where you add a program. Scroll down again is remove a program. And these two are the um, the user added programs. So you, what you will do is add your own. There are two in here already that are uh, default to the purchase of it has one. The usage uh, selection, and I'll click on that real quick, shows you how much, uh, for instance, your uh, if you're running a freezer and you're cooling, uh, how much the freezer's been running the previous day, week, month. Uh, select enter again, and it shows you if you've been heating it, uh, so how much your heater's been running. All right, hit and select again, or the enter again will get you back to the main menu. Um, and then the setup menu is the last one. There's quite a few things under here. Um, the temperature scale you can select here. Select between Fahrenheit and Celsius. Uh, and this is the delta temperature, and this is what you set to sh for how often you want the thermostat to kick on or off. So right now it's set to two degrees. So the temperature will be two degrees above the set temperature before it'll kick on the cooling unit. So if you want it to run less often, you would select the button here and then scroll clockwise to scroll up to the number of degrees. It goes up to nine, down to one. Two is the default. Select there. Uh, contrast uh, selects the uh, contrast of the LCD screen. Uh, it's hard to see a little bit on the video, but but the default setting for most of the ones I've seen uh, have been the default setting seems to work okay. So shouldn't hopefully won't have to change that much. Uh, demo mode we'll cover that in a little bit. The function um, you set to heat or cool. So whichever if you have a heater uh, plugged in to the thermostat, you set this function to heat and otherwise if you have a freezer or a fridge or other wise cooling uh, device set it to cool. Uh, the clock uh, is mainly for debug but that shows you what the clock is. Essentially that shows you the exact time of the current stage of the program you're running or or if there's no program since you've selected with the current setting. Um, the reset device will reset all of the uh, settings back to default settings. It'll erase all your user programs, all the settings you've changed since you, you've gotten it. Um, just select yes and hit enter, it'll reset everything. Um, I'll go ahead and do that. And it, once you click it, it does take a second. So I click it here, and it takes about two seconds before it goes back to the main menu so it, you see it's doing something uh, and the about it just shows you the hardware and software version uh, that your particular device has okay exit I'll go back again um, give you a quick overview of the of the set and reset this is where you turn it on and off so you select this to do uh, to disable it uh, it's just as easy to you know 
instead of unplugging it, you would have the select option to select here to off, so it doesn't. It's not actually controlling anything. Um, uh, if you select the manual temperature, it goes over and gives you an option to change the the value that you want it to set to. Now let's say set it to 55. You hit enter, go back to the the screen, the menu. And you say you scroll back, hit back, and you see that it kicks on uh, the relay. The LED shows the relay status. Uh, set temperature 55. The actual temperature 71. All right. To go back to the menu, um, it also has the default logger, the default ale that I've put in there. The on tap selection shows you how to um, if you are just storing a particular beer. Um, you go up here and you select, let's say you have a blonde on tap, select that, you go back to the main screen and it shows it's set at 39 degrees, that's what I have it set at. Currently this is not um, set up to add or adjust those, um, that's coming very soon. So yeah, that's a quick overview of the, the menu system, I'll go over adding and removing a program uh, in another video. Hope you enjoy it. Thanks. Bye.